Let's now take a look at the instrument panel and the master display. With the ignition on, the vehicle will do its self-checks, taking approximately two seconds. Here you have the speedo, and at the bottom you have any speed-related features selected, highlighted, such as cruise or speed limiter. The combined fuel and AdBlue gauge and engine temperature. You have the rev counter and at the bottom gear selection, manual or auto and on manual models this is also where gear change prompting will be shown. Moving across you have the natural mapping where all active warnings will be highlighted to you and additional vehicle info such as fog lights and hill start aid active. Programmable body application warnings and information lights are also shown in this area, which are primarily blue, depending on the vehicle application you have. Moving up to the master display, a very informative and interactive system. To display, simply press the menu control switch once and you'll see the menu. Scrolling the control switch to the left or the right, you can highlight the various menu selections and press to enter further into that menu, such as the trip information here. To exit this selection, press the return button once to jump back up one level, or press and hold for a count of two to exit completely.